Welcome, I'm Dr. Eli Sluch, and today we're going to be talking about panretinal photocoagulation, or PRP. Vascular occlusive diseases such as proliferative diabetic retinopathy, vein occlusions, or artery occlusions can lead to new abnormal blood vessels to start growing in the eye, which may cause large hemorrhages, glaucoma, or retinal detachment. This can be treated with injections, or as a more permanent solution, a laser can be used to burn off the peripheral non-functioning retina to decrease the drive of the new blood vessel production. Treatment is recommended at the first onset of new blood vessel formation. The longer we wait, the higher the chance of complications such as hemorrhages, retinal detachments, or glaucoma. Injections can sometimes be used to help delay the treatment. The eye is first numbed with lidocaine to minimize any discomfort and a contact lens is placed on the eye. The laser is then used to burn the non-functioning peripheral retina to decrease its demand for new blood vessel formation. The laser treatment may feel a little uncomfortable and is sometimes separated into several treatment sessions. The procedure is well tolerated and has a small set of risks associated with it. Most patients will have eye discomfort for a few days after the procedure. Rare complications include choroidal effusions, retinal detachments, ocular edema, visual field constriction, decreased night vision, decreased vision, and need for more surgery. If you have any questions about the procedure, we'll go over it during a consultation visit.